Could there be life on a distant planet 124 light years away hiding in the cosmic shadows? Welcome to the mystery of K218b, a world that's got astronomers buzzing with excitement and skepticism. Today we're diving into the latest data from the James Webb Space Telescope to uncover what makes this exoplanet so special. So, buckle up as we explore whether K218b could be a home for alien life. K218b is no ordinary planet. It's 8.6 times Earth's mass and 2.6 times its size, orbiting a cool dwarf star in the habitable zone, where liquid water might exist. Scientists call it a Hycean world, a rare type of planet with a hydrogen-rich atmosphere and possibly vast oceans. But what's got everyone talking are the gases detected in its atmosphere hinting at something extraordinary. So, how do we know what's in K218b's atmosphere? Enter the James Webb Space Telescope, or JWST, a cosmic detective with a golden mirror that captures light from the universe's farthest reaches. JWST uses a technique called transit spectroscopy. When K218b passes in front of its star, a transit, some of the star's light filters through the planet's atmosphere. Different chemicals absorb specific wavelengths of light, creating a unique fingerprint. JWST's super-sensitive instruments like NIRIS, NERSPEC, and MIRI analyze these wavelengths to reveal the atmosphere's chemical makeup. In 2023, JWST's first look at K218b revealed methane and carbon dioxide, gases that could form naturally but also hint at life. Even more exciting there was a weak signal of dimethyl sulfide or DMS, a molecule produced on Earth by marine microbes through anaerobic respiration. But the signal was faint, like a whisper in the data, and scientists weren't sure. Fast forward to April 2024 when JWST's MIRI instrument took a closer look. The results published in April 2025 showed a stronger signal, not just DMS but also dimethyl disulfide or DMDS, at levels thousands of times higher than on Earth. This jumped from a shaky 1 sigma confidence to a 3 sigma, meaning a 99.7% chance it's real. That's a big deal. Why does this matter? On Earth DMS and DMDS are almost exclusively made by living things like phytoplankton in our oceans. If K218b has these gases it could suggest microbial life in a global ocean. But here's the catch. K218b is an Earth. Its thick hydrogen atmosphere and massive size make it more like a sub-Neptune with a possible high-pressure ice layer or even a superheated ocean. Some scientists think the DMS signal might be noise or just methane in disguise. Others say non-biological processes like chemical reactions in the atmosphere could mimic these gases. We're not at the Eureka moment yet, the signal needs to hit 5 Sigma, the gold standard for discovery. The good news? More JWST observations are planned for 2025 and beyond, aiming to confirm DMS and DMDS. Future telescopes might even give us a clearer picture. For now, K218b is a tantalizing maybe, a world that could redefine what we think is possible for life in the universe. So, let's circle back to our question. Could there be life on K218b? Is this planet a cosmic cradle for alien microbes, or just a chemical trickster? I want to hear your thoughts. Drop a comment below with your take. Do you think K218b is the real deal, or are we chasing a mirage? Hit that like button, subscribe for more cosmic adventures, and let's keep exploring the universe together.